everyone so hopefully I'm filming the correct way today <laughs> uh, I hate it when videos are like sideways like that it's so annoying but I am going to do a what's in our pantry um, it might be kind of dark I'm really sorry it'll be really quick I promise um, I'll just do a little o overview of things I try to keep stocked in our pantry so uh, here's our little pantry and oh it's not too dark okay so up here I have some cereal it's like the fiber one um, brand you can do a lot of stuff with it but I don't I have popcorn which I don't really eat that often some um, abuelita or however you say it hot chocolate that I don't even think it's been opened I like to keep these fiber one bars um, just if I have a sweet tooth and these little Belvita chocolate things which are kind of high in calories so that I don't know. I like to think they're healthy for you. Maybe I'm kidding myself. And over here, if you're British, you will know what this is. <laughs> but um, a lot of like that is for cooking. Cooking, like I don't really mess with that too much. But over here, um, I have oatmeal. I just buy the HEB brand. I have some Irish steel cut ones back there. And I do those in the crock pot overnight with like cinnamon and apples. Um, just depending on how like homemakerish I'm feeling. Generally, I don't, so that's why I have a huge tub of <laughs> oatmeal. Okay, and then I have quinoa. I usually buy it in the box, um, but I couldn't find it. So H-E-B sells it loose, and you just fill up a little bag. I make that instead of rice a lot of times. And behind all that, we have pasta, and I actually have a box for Yorkshire pudding that I have had forever that I should probably make as a little treat sometime. Um, I love the Valentina hot sauce. It says it has zero calories. I don't know if I ever believe that, but you know, I use it a lot. I have two bottles of it because I left, I bought one at my parents' house and left it there. My mom was like, here, you can take this home. Um, and behind that, I have peanut butter, which I, I do eat a lot of peanut butter. I like it with apples or in a chocolate smoothie. And then I have my two smoothies. I have a chocolate one back there, which I'm almost out of. I couldn't find this brand again. I really liked it, but... And then I'm trying this vanilla one by Aria. And it's low in calories, high in protein. And I just mix that with some fruit. I'll do... Someone asked for a video on it, so I'll do a video on that um, another night. And then here is just like all... Now it's getting dark. My spices, salt and pepper. Back there is like different seasonings. Um, over here... I have syrup for pancakes, which I used to have, like, um, waffles or something every morning, but I have since not. I eat a more protein-like breakfast. Um, I have some stevia and little packets and truvia behind it and a box of prunes. How lovely. They're actually really good. They're the individually wrapped ones, and they're pretty delicious, I'm just saying. Um, and then back there, oh, I left my tea. I was going to have, oops, let me close it. Um... I was going to have tea this morning, but I changed my mind on the type of tea I was having. These three things I used to have sitting out on my counter at our condo, um, but I just don't have, I don't like a cluttered kitchen, and I don't have a lot of room for them here. Plus, I really don't use them all that often, except for, obviously, my little tea one. And I have these, which my one of my best friends introduced to me. They're the Ziploc Zippin' Steam Bags. These work really, really good. Um... I should do that tonight with a zucchini. Um, and it gives you the times and amount. I mean, they're amazing. Like, you need them in your life. Um, I have flour. Oops, no, this doesn't want to stay. Actually, it's usually up here in between that. <laughs> um, I have flour, different flavorings. This is all of my canned stuff. We eat a lot of, like, um, low-sodium black beans, um, different canned vegetables. I have a little thing of, like, chicken and dumpling soup from... I think it's the H-E-B brand. Yeah, I really like it. most of H-E-B brand stuff. I have a little taco thing that actually should go up here. Anyway, so that's just all the different kind of seasoning stuff I have. I mean, not seasonings. Wow. Um, different canned stuff. I keep canned vegetables, a lot of canned beans, and like tomato sauce. If I'm going to make some pasta or something, I generally make my own um, like pasta sauce. And then down here is my little tea place. I love that store, Tivana. Oh my gosh, it's like one of my favorite places ever. And then I've actually never tried the <laughs> vanilla white apricot Tazo tea. Um, so if anyone's tried that, you should let me know. And then, of course, the passion tea. And then my favorite um, green tea is this one. I also have it in bags. I prefer the bags, but um, this is cheaper to buy. 
And then a lot of this is just like, there's some Lawrence's cereal he has in the morning. Crackers. And I have cookbooks back there, which um, I don't use very often. These are really good cookbooks, sorry. Um, the Hungry Girl ones, I have two of them. Um, those are really good cookbooks, so... Oh, Jesus. Okay, we're good, though. And then the rest is just pretty self-explanatory. So, I hope that, I don't know, gave you a little bit of insight. I try to keep mainly healthy things at home, so I'm not tempted, but that is it. And I hope y'all are having a great day, and I will talk to you later. Bye.